Hi everyone, my name is Sibo and welcome back to Littlewood. Today is Thursday, August 20th, day 11 of spring. How's everyone day going? That's been alright. Just been uh, a chill day after uh, my day out yesterday to Niagara. Mandragoras. <laughs> All right, a little. But yeah, going to Niagara was quite fun. Uh, we actually avoided a lot of the touristy kind of things. Hey, do I just wanted to tell you something very important? Um, and we did like hikes instead, and walked around, ate ate pizza, got some cow's ice cream, which was very good. I'm leaving Twilight forever! I don't, I don't think so, Dalton. <laughs> ah, you should have seen the look on your face. I'm not going anywhere. But I do have important news. I'm going to restock my shop every day now instead of just Tuesdays and Thursdays. Wait, what? That's amazing. <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face. Alright, Dalton. Did you know that if you leave tree stumps, the trees will grow back? Wait, what? Kind of logic. <laughs> it's super useful to have regrowing trees here in the town for extra wood. Here, why don't you try planting a tree stump? Oh, let's go. A blueprint for a, blue print, a, blue print for a tree stump. Here, let's see what else you uh, have to say. Some folks believe that you, there are special totems that you can transform your regular trees into special trees. I've never seen one of those before, though. How interesting. How peculiar. <laughs> hey, so, you don't remember anything from before you defeated the Dark Wizard? Your favorite color? Your favorite food? Your favorite friend? Oh, Willow. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what I'm saying. Everyone in Twilight likes Dwight. <laughs> That's what you're saying. Hey, Dwight. Deli has been teaching me some neat meditation tricks. Now, whenever I get upset, I can calm down by... A bug just flew in my mouth. Blech. Get out, get out, it's disgusting. Alright. <laughs> But yeah, no, we went to Niagara yesterday, um, had a lot of fun. The pizza place we went to was like a uh, Napoleon-style pizza place. It was very, very good. Um, we had a white pizza and a red pizza, so to those who are not aware, white pizza is when they don't have tomato sauce, red pizzas are when they do have tomato, uh, tomato sauce. Um, so the white pizza we got was a... Uh, had what did I add on it? I had prosciutto, I had arugula, I had um, mozzarella cheese, and cherry tomatoes. Very, very good. It was so good. <laughs> now, normally I'm not able to eat like cherry tomatoes um, and like cucumbers and such. I think it's because of the skin, um, like the pesticides and whatnot. I'm not really sure, but um, this pizza was like. Like, I was able to eat it, no problem. Hey, do I. I have an important question for you. Which townsfolk do you find the most beautiful? I'll let you think about your answer carefully. Touch your heart, I am the most beautiful. Well, every, every, you know it to be true. <laughs> oh no, Bubsy, Bubsy's Darth Vader. Hold on, before we do that, yeah, sure, let's donate to the coffee shop. Uh, what do we want more of today? I think, I think let's, let's go, let's go mining today. Let's get a nutty cocoa. Let's focus on mining. Oh, 
Let's also uh, take a visit to the cavern. Or sorry, not the cavern, the tavern. Before we go to the cavern. But yeah, the other pizza we got was a more traditional um, like pepper. Did I have pepperoni? I'm not really sure. <laughs> Some sort of spicy sausage, um, mushrooms, uh, mozzarella cheese. That one. That one was okay. It was basically a Canadian pizza, <laughs> so it was it was fine. Um, kind of rich, um, so I could eat. I couldn't eat as much of that pizza um, compared to the other one, the the uh, the one with uh, prosciutto and arugula, which makes sense because uh, the one with the prosciutto and arugula is lighter and um, I don't know. There's less. Uh, you know, food fatigue, taste fatigue from it, if that makes any sense. Okay, honestly, what do you think my mind here? Pretty sick, right? Got these goggles for only 15 dirtjobs on the black market. <laughs> How is Toad's Wars getting progressively worse and worse? <laughs> Hold on, let me let me think. What kind of voice will we give uh, this new NPC? Hey, you there! Could you lend me a hand? These wampers are trying to eat me. I dropped my whistle over there. Grab it and blow it. I don't I don't know what accent that is. <laughs> a whistle? Where'd you where'd you? Oh. Oh, <laughs> that was a close one. Thanks a lot for helping me out there. The name's Ash. I'm a dust miner. Huh? Dwy? Isn't that the name of the hero, Solon? Whoa, you're the hero? Right on. It's an honor to meet you, Dwy. I have to be more careful down here from now on. I can't keep count on being saved by a hero. Say, I've got to repay you somehow for helping me out. S somehow slowly more thing to a southern accent. You live in Dwellin', right? Everyone's always talking about that place. I'll come visit sometime, bring you a nice present. Yo. Those wampas sure are wild. I can't really blame, 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 blame them for attacking us miners, though. This is their home. Unfortunately, I got a dewdrop somehow. Okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> cool story, bro. But yeah, after we went for pizza, uh, we went for cow's ice cream, which is like, honestly, one of the best <laughs> ice creams I ever had the, fr the privilege to eat. It was so good. So rich, so creamy. Um, got a, like a, a, a cheesecake flavored ice cream, like a New York cheesecake flavored ice cream. Um, and then I got some other flavor ice cream that I don't really remember, but that was also really good. Um, yeah, honestly, it was just very, very solid <laughs> ice cream. Would highly recommend. Um, cows, cows ice cream. They also have their own like merchandise and everything. So um, I just got like a couple mugs. And uh, also a, a stuffed animal, very a very derpy stuffed animal, <laughs> very derpy cow. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's head back home. Save the energy for other things. Actually, maybe head into the endless forest um, in case we have like a special encounter or something. Did you drink enough water today? I do not want anyone passing out in there. The whirly bug's my favorite animal. My second favorite is the squiggly dude, of which I still don't know what that is. <laughs> Uh, 
At the very least, we can collect some uh, dewdrops here. And some wood. Just, just some free wood laying in a chest. Why not? We can't collect these yet, right? Yeah. We need higher gathering skills. All right, cool. I don't know, I, uh, <laughs> I don't often eat ice cream, um, so when I do, I'm like, I want it to be good ice cream, <laughs> and a cow's ice cream definitely hit that mark for me, um, it's not that, like, I, I dislike ice cream, which is why I don't eat it that much, no, far, far from it, I actually really like ice cream, it's just, uh, normally I, I don't really eat that many, uh, desserts. In general, I think it's just a. Uh, I don't really have a dessert stomach, <laughs> so once I get full of like food from the main meal, then uh, I don't usually have room for dessert. <laughs> Which maybe I need to rethink of my lifestyle if that is the case. Is there any NPCs we haven't talked to yet? I don't think so. Um, in which case... Let's go ahead and... Make some bricks. Because we are lacking in the bricks. In fact, we will uh, top off on brick making. <laughs> so you have 10 bricks now. Um, all in a day's work. I will say, one thing about this game that, uh, might prove problematic in the future is that collecting resources will, will take some time, so it might take, like, a week to collect enough materials to make stuff in the future. Um, uh, which, you know what, honestly, it'll be, it'll be fine, it's just, uh, this playthrough will be pretty slow-paced. So, if you ever wanted to, uh, j you know, jump on ahead, if you ever get impatient, I highly suggest playing this game yourself and having a lot of fun with it. Ship Hall's Wallpaper. Yes, we want this because I believe, um, what's-his-face <laughs> wants that. Dudley. Dudley wants a ship hall. Wallpaper. No. Yes. Yes, you do. Okay. Cool. 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 I keep thinking that <laughs> you require, you need like crafting materials to make the wallpaper, but no, you just, you just have it once you buy the blueprint, which is nice. It's not like uh, Animal Crossing where you need a. Uh, once you buy the blueprint, or you know, in, in Animal Crossing case, the DIY, you would need uh, additional materials to make the things. But in this in this case, uh, for the most part, you just if, once you have the blueprint, you you have have the thing. Um, at least when it comes to wallpapers. Okay, interesting. So, so we could plant some trees if we really wanted to. I don't think it will. Um, we have enough trees in Dwyland for now. But it is good to uh, keep in mind. All right, I think let's uh, let's let's compliment Dalton <laughs> since he is providing everyday shop supplies now. You're so cool, Dwy, and you're really gonna give me compliments. Talking to Dalton made me so exhausted. You know what, honestly? That's a mood. <laughs> to not realize talking to people uh, makes uh, you pass out. Alright, well, um, note to self. Save some energy 
or talking <laughs> in the future. You know, honestly, I can relate to that. Um, as an introvert, it's uh, can be very draining uh, socializing with people. So uh, yeah. <laughs> Well, hopefully uh, tomorrow will be a little bit better. <laughs> Thank you everyone for watching. This has been Sebo. This has been uh, Littlewood. And I'll see you guys tomorrow on Friday. Have a wonderful Thursday. No, no, duh, you didn't sleep well last night. <laughs> You passed out in front of Dalton, and Dalton decided to just leave you hanging on the road. <laughs> after after you gave a compliment to him. The audacity of this man. 